In DC, it never used to be a problem because that was always a transitory medium. Marvel always had a continuity. We were always bound to the continuity. My objection to Grant was not Cassandra Nova and that whole story. It was making the X-Men public because that destroyed the one fundamental thing that differentiated the X-Canon from every other canon in the Marvel Universe. There weren't a lot of mutants and everybody was scared of them and no one knew where they were. The minute they became public, why, how are they different in any way, shape, manner, or form from the Avengers, the Defenders, any other group in the Marvel Universe? Rogue is now an Avenger. Who cares? Who cares? She's an Avenger. She's another suit. It's like, why are we X-Men? I don't know. Why, are, why aren't we Defenders? Why aren't we Secret Six? Why aren't we anybody? They've lost their uniqueness. And Stan's one specific was every hero, every team, every person had to have something unique. The one fatal flaw that Stan recognized in Iron Man was anyone could wear the armor. Nothing made Iron Man unique. Tony Stark? Yes. Iron Man? No. Spider-Man was unique. No one else could be him. No one but Peter Parker. <laughs> Except Miles over there. And that's the, the, but that's, that's the problem. The X-Men were unique until they became public and then they just became like everybody else.